Hi, Greg. What do you have here? Uh, this is our model D4 data acquisition conditioner. It's a simple, uh, very easy to use four channel static test instrument um, that allows you to connect uh, strain gauges or strain gauge based transducers uh, simply with an RJ45 connector. You can plug in quarter bridge, half bridge, full bridge circuits into this just with the click on RJ45. Oh, cool. Even strain gauges that are glued on to a composite? Right, like right. this one? Yeah. And it uh, is USB powered, so um, it has a connection on the back side that uh, connects directly to a computer, and your computer uh, the software is included with it that runs this. Basically, uh, our very popular model D3, or P3 rather, that uh, has been in use for many years. This has all the same capability, but in a much reduced size and shape and more portable. Nice. Um, the USB power runs it, um, supplies, takes the uh, data from it, uh, gives real-time graphing, uh, real-time displays, and records data from it. Tell me what rate can you record data from it? Um, it is a static test instrument, so it's sampling in the one to eight samples per second per channel range. Okay. So it's not meant for high speed data collection, gotcha. but for static type tests. Gotcha. And you said it connects to the computer through a USB connection? Well, it's USB to, yes, uh, can go into any USB part on a laptop or a computer. Nice. And another thing that's nice about it is um, the software can actually read up to six of these simultaneously. So you could have up to 24 channels of data running simultaneously right. with these. Cool. And you can also, of course, connect a three element rosette like this one where you've got three sensitive grids plus one box you said has what? Uh, four, four channels. Four channels. Yeah, right. so you can connect a rosette to it. Um, and read each of the elements separately. Nice. Um, it, it, it provides um, shunt calibration, bridge completion, all of the standard data acquisition instrument. Uh, so if I were using a rosette, what you're saying is I could use a 120 or 350 ohm. Or even a 1,000 ohm. Or even a 1,000 ohm rosette right. connected into that box. Mm -hmm. Wow, yeah, that's fantastic. So small size. Probably what about the size of maybe a external uh, hard drive? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Small wireless routers. What I was thinking, it kind of reminds me of one of my wireless routers at home. Yep. Uh, small size, portable, USB power, and you got four channels of capability, right? Right. Nice. I like it.